The return of the osprey is a sure sign that spring has arrived. But the ospreys on utility poles can be problematic if the nests or birds make contact with live wires. As a result, there can be power outages and the osprey can be killed by either electricity or a resulting fire. On Thursday, an InStar crew removed a nest on Nashawina Street in West Falmouth. The nest had been knocked down the day before, but a pair of osprey were back rebuilding it even as the InStar crew arrived. Once the nest was removed, corrugated tubing was secured on top of the pole to prevent them from rebuilding in that location. InStar has been working with the State Division of Fisheries and Wildlife to protect the osprey by removing their nests or by building platforms to encourage them to relocate. Earlier in the week, NSTAR lead project manager of construction, Brian McDevitt, took to the skies in a helicopter to fly over NSTAR's Cape transmission lines, searching for any newly built nests. He found that the Ospreys had chosen to nest on platforms built by NSTAR rather than utility structures their Osprey relocation program had worked. At one location in West Barnstable, where Instar had removed a nest, staff from the town's Marine Environmental Affairs Department, West Barnstable Fire Department, Mass Autobahn, Barnstable Land Trust, and local volunteers gathered to erect a platform near Bridge Creek. The hope is that the displaced Osprey will re-nest there. Destroyed by NSTAR, partially because of the concern about the bird, but those birds weren't given any um, opportunity or alternate um, plan or nest. So uh, the community came together here um, to build a new nest.